is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. Emergency crews in Knott County responded to a boating accident Saturday night around 9 p.m. on Car Creek Lake. Upon arrival, first responders were told the boat carrying five passengers crashed into the bank at a high rate of speed. Officials with the Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife say it appears an equipment failure caused the crash. The boat, uh, after we looked at it, uh, we actually, the report was that it was a failure of the seat and uh, we did check the seat and uh, the seat actually was attached to the floor but it looked like there was some dry rot uh, in the wood and uh, undoubtedly that was probably uh, the factor that caused the seat to collapse. Two passengers, including an 11-year-old child, were flown to Cabell Huntington Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Officer Pigman said alcohol was not a factor in the crash, which appears to be just an unfortunate accident. But he did say this weekend's boat crash is a perfect illustration of why all newer boats come equipped with a lanyard attached to the ignition switch. And a boat of this age probably didn't come with a lanyard, but that is just a critical safety factor. And all PWCs are required to have them, and they're actually required to wear them. So uh, had this boat had it uh, when he fell out of the seat, uh, could have possibly shut the engine off, may have still hit the bank, but it could have definitely lessened the impact. And with Labor Day weekend just a few weeks away and the boating season still in full swing, Officer Pigman advises everyone to follow all boating laws and use caution when on the water. Reporting in Knott County for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.